What's up guys, how's it going? Just had an awesome adventure today. Made it to Evan City, Pennsylvania to check out the Night of the Living Dead filming locations. It was super awesome. If you guys haven't been there, totally worth checking it out. With that being said, I realized that I forgot to film any sort of intro for this video, so better late than never, here it is, enjoy. It has been established that persons who have recently died have been returning to life and committing acts of murder. Hey, gentlemen, dude. we're coming back on the air after an interruption due to technical problems. Nothing wrong with the radio. Must have been the station. Which row is it in? All right, so I am in Evans Park Cemetery in Evans City, Pennsylvania. And this is the exact location where they filmed Night of the Living Dead. Right here is the actual gravestone where they went to visit. And there was actually a tree here, but I was told a tornado took that down a long time ago. But actually the way it looked in the movie was almost this angle right here. Yeah, a little spit and polish, you can clean this up. Sell it next year. Wonder how many times we bought the same one. And then you can see, it's right up the road from the chapel and they would have been parked right there. They're coming to get you, Barbara. Stop it, you're ignorant. They're coming for you, Barbara. Stop it. You're acting like a child. Look, they're coming for you. Look, there comes one of them now. city you'll come across this which is pretty cool that's where we were earlier that's at the cemetery that's the chapel And this is where we're going to next. This is the uh, where the farmhouse is. And one of my favorite movies George A. Romero did was The Crazies, also filmed in this town. I don't know what that is. It's very fitting. This is private property now, but right where that cabin is out there, that's where the farmhouse stood. And the famous picture you see with all the ghouls crossing 
is right through that field across this road. And that's where about the entire movie was shot, right there at that cabin. And this is actually the bridge where they filmed one of the scenes. There was in the movie, they had a big covering on the top. It's no longer there anymore. Everywhere you look, there's zombies all over the city. And this is it, downtown Evans City. Super cool. I think we have some late word of just arriving and I'll interrupt to bring this to you. This is the latest disclosure in a report from National Civil Defense Headquarters in Washington. It has been established that persons who have recently died have been returning to life and committing acts of murder. I like this guy, check him out. As I said before, if you guys haven't checked this out, it is awesome, especially for the horror nerds out there like me. Uh, it's about two and a half hours from Cleveland, so it's really, really not that far, especially for everyone that's local around my area. Um, it's, it's a quick drive. It's a really, really nice drive, uh, and it's certainly worth it. I think it was five bucks to get into the museum, um, and, and everything else is free. You can tour the whole area. Um, so bring some friends and uh, definitely bring along a copy of the movie like I did because that way you're able to kind of view it and double check and see kind of where you're at. But uh, it's a fun trip. I'm glad you guys uh, checked out my video. Thank you so much for watching it. I don't know if I'm going to do a vlog thing for, uh, for very long, but I figured I might as well give it a shot and uh, see what happens. So if you like this video, shoot me a like, let me know, and uh, next adventure I will bring you along as well. Thanks, guys. Later.